Hi everyone, I hope you are doing fine. In this video, I will be showing you 10 words we use in Quebec English that we normally don't use outside of this province. This is due to the French influence. This should not be a surprise to you since most people in Quebec are Francophones. So here are the 10 words. The first one is animator. Now, generally, in English, an animator is someone who draws cartoons or comic strips, like the one for Garfield or The Simpsons. But in Quebec, we also use animator to talk about a person who entertains children, like at a summer camp or a special activity at school. The second word is auto route. Elsewhere, we would say highway, expressway, or freeway. For example, if you know about Los Angeles in California, they have many freeways. Well, in Quebec English, we talk about auto routes, like auto route 10 from Montreal to Sherbrooke. The next word is dépanneur, or in short, dape. For example, I'm going to the dape to get some milk. A dépanneur or dape is simply a convenience store. The next word is formation. Now, in English, in general English, you could have a formation in a parade where, for example, people in the parade have a particular, say, place in the parade that gives a form. But in Quebec English, we also use formation to talk about training. For example, a formation to become a teacher. The next word I'll be talking to you about is guichet. A guichet is simply a bank machine or an ATM. For example, I'm going to the guichet to withdraw $20. Next, we have terrasse. A terrasse is simply a terrace or patio. For example, Montreal is known for its terraces, where people sit outside to eat and drink when the weather's nice. Next, we have garderie. A garderie is simply a daycare, a place where we keep children while mommies and daddies are working. Garderie. Then we have the expression, pass the vacuum, or pass the mop. This simply means vacuuming or mopping to keep your floors cleaned. Two more to go. Number nine, we have dore. A dore is a type of fish, which is called a walleye. Now, if you don't know what is a dore or walleye, you can always do a Google search. And finally, we have coordinates. Coordinates means your contact information, like your address, telephone number, email. So those are 10 popular expressions we use in Quebec English. Now, there's no problem using them if you're talking to people in Quebec. But be aware, though, if you're in Ontario or another place, that they might not understand you if you use these words and those meanings. So thanks for watching, and as usual, have a nice day.